Hey guys, Brittany from Atlas here. Today I want to talk to you about one of the best ways to reduce neck injuries. Now neck injuries tend to be more chronic. I'm not talking about, you know, falling and hitting your head or a car accident, whiplash, that kind of thing. More the chronic um, arthritis, degenerative joint disease, debulging discs, pinched nerves, kind of the common things people tend to come in after years of working their necks far too hard and have pain. So actually one of the best ways to know if you are putting too much strain on your neck joints is to stop and feel where the work is or where the strain is when you're doing something. So with the neck, the spinal joints are right down the middle. If you feel those little bony prominences down the middle of your spine, those are the spinal joints. Those are the areas we don't wanna feel a lot of direct pain, pressure or stinging or burning, anything like that. Whereas to the sides is kind of mushy muscle. That's where we want work to happen, especially down here in like the shoulders. That's where we want a lot of work to happen if we're doing things. Some common times that we tend to put strain on our neck without realizing it are looking down for long periods of time. So looking at our phones is one, and then we hang our head. And if you stop and you can feel pressure right along the spine there, uh, or even just any kind of work along that area, you know you're putting too much pressure on those joints. Uh, that could be doing hobbies too, doing a puzzle, drawing, anything where you're looking at playing the piano, all things where you tend to crane your head down, you can be putting too much pressure on those joints. The best ways to counter this are to adjust your posture. So see if you can sit in a different way. Say, say if you're working on a project, can you bring the project up? Uh, if you like to do art, can you get an easel to put on so you can do your art up there? If you like to do puzzles, they actually have puzzle raisers. So you can have the puzzle up here instead of down where you're having to look over it. Doing it on a counter versus a table, which is too low for you. Things like that to just get the pressure out of your neck get it more neutralized so that you're not putting as much strain on your joints. If you have more questions about if you're doing something right or if you're gonna be hurting your neck while you do a posture or an exercise or an activity, ask your Atlas provider. They can give you lots of guidance on that. All right guys, we'll see you next time.